Hi everybody, Tom Forgione here. I wanted to go over some uh, more marketing hacks for you to help you uh, grow your business. And I wanted to talk today about offers. Now, offers are very important. Offers are what you use in your advertising and marketing to help you attract customers into your business. And then once you attract them into your business, it's your job to keep marketing to them so they continuously purchase and do business with you and stay your customer and refer all their friends. That's the goal. So you want to make sure that your offer is very strong. Now there's two really important uh, types of offers. There's an offer to get new customers and then there's an offer to keep existing customers. Now before creating any offer you need to know your LTV or lifetime value of that customer or client. Without knowing that, you can't craft any offers. Because once you know that number, then you could figure out how strong the offer can be to get them to become a new customer or to stay a customer. Without knowing that data, you're really gambling. And this is not gambling, this is marketing. Okay? If you have a long lifetime value of a customer, Consider giving them as much as possible up front to get them into your marketing system. Now, if you don't have a marketing system, don't do this. You need a way to keep remarketing to your customers if you're going to give them a great first deal because you want to make that money back, right? The money that you're going to give them as, a, uh, as an offer, okay? So you want to have a strong lifetime value and a marketing system in place. Now, a great way to get new customers, and I know a lot of you are going to cringe when you hear this, is by giving them a risk reversal offer. Now, a risk reversal offer is if you don't like the product, within 30 days you return it, you get all your money back. 100% money back guarantee if you're not satisfied for any reason. Now, that's a strong offer but it takes away all the objections of somebody trying to do business with you or thinking about doing business with you. They might be on the fence and they're not sure. <clears throat> and this offer, if it doesn't work, you have to reevaluate all your marketing, okay? So, now that's a big thing to ask for most companies to do. I suggest you try it. If I had a real problem with your product, and I called you and contacted you after purchasing it, even if you didn't offer this guarantee, and I really had a problem, but I was going to stay your customer or not tell everybody else how poorly you treated me, wouldn't you give me my money back? So isn't that the same thing? You're just promoting it. There have been some studies that show that only 2%, up to 2% of the people will take you up on the offer. They just will go away if the product's no good. So if you're worried about losing your money, I wouldn't worry. I think the, the benefit far outweighs the risk. But give it a shot. You could always test it. And then if it gets to be out of hand, you got to take it down. So let's say you're, you give that kind of offer and you're getting a lot of returns. Well, that means that <clears throat> excuse me, something is wrong <clears throat> with the offer, with the product. Something needs to be fixed. It, this is an important step. You need to see what the problem is if you're getting a lot of returns. So it'll help you in a lot of ways. Okay. Now when you're crafting your offer, it's important to know also that you want to use the rule of 100. That means that if your product is sold at $100 or less, you give a percentage off. If it's $100 or more, you give a dollar amount off. So for example, if you're selling a $25 product, you could say 20% off of anything over $25. If it's a $100 product, you could say $10 or $20 off anything over $100. It works better in the mind when you do something like that. It's easier for people to understand and calculate. And when it's under 100, it's not that big of a uh, stretch when it's over a hundred they like to see that that dollar amount so they could easily calculate it okay um, 
so that's called, like I said, the rule of 100. And you can look that up on Google and check out many other uh, articles and videos on that. I have an article on my website that explains offers in more detail. There's a link below. Click it and check it out. You don't have to sign up for anything to read it. It's free. And um, if you found this video valuable, I would appreciate it if you, you know, forward it to a friend or let someone know about it. Uh, share it on Facebook. I'd appreciate that. Okay? And if you uh, have any questions or concerns or comments, please uh, leave a comment or give us a call at the office, and I'd be happy to help you craft a great offer to attract a flood of customers to your business. Okay? Have a great day.